Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, Lord. As Jesus approached Jericho, a blind man was sitting by the roadside begging. And hearing a crowd going by, he inquired what was happening. They told him, Jesus of Nazareth is passing by. And he shouted, Jesus, son of David, have pity on me. And the people walking in front rebuked him, telling him to be silent. But he kept calling out all the more, Son of David, have pity on me. Then Jesus stopped and ordered that he brought, be brought to him. And when he came near, Jesus asked him, What do you want me to do for you? And he replied, Lord, please let me see. Jesus told him, Have sight. Your faith has saved you. He immediately received his sight and followed him, giving glory to God. When they saw this, all the people gave praise to God. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, praise to you, Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ. Saint Ignatius of Loyola had a uh, wonderful tradition which he's taught his uh, folks that were in the Jesuits and of course they taught us that uh, we imagine ourselves being entering into the gospel and so we sit with the blind man and we cry out with him Jesus son of David have pity on us and allowing that prayer to really enter our lives and then Jesus witnessing Jesus stopping and talking to us and asking us directly what do you want me to do for you and experiencing Lord please let me see and that can be see sight see sight or see sight and so in entering that, uh, we experience Jesus in a new way every single time we do that. And it becomes for us an opportunity to give glory to God, either for what the healing has taken place or the insight that we have or the experience of entering deeper into the love of Jesus Christ. And so let us pray for that grace during this Eucharist. <clears throat> 